Oh my god. <laughs> I have really gotta stop doing that. <laughs> oh my I can I'm gonna be blind by the time that I leave this video. That's the wrong brush. Mm -hmm. Already blind. Confirmed. So hi guys. What's up? So it is like day 117 of quarantine. I don't even know. I honestly forgot it was March. So today I'm gonna do my face. I think I'm gonna do <laughs> I feel like it can't just be me that you like you sniffle or you like cough once and you're like coronavirus so I'm gonna do skincare first because that's the most important to get your face your base face to stick so this is what I've been doing I'm using this the ordinary caffeine solution for my eyeballs you use just like a little tiny bit Kinda rub that shit in. Rub that shit in. <laughs> I don't know why I am the way I am. Okay, so then I'm gonna do this little wet and wild lip scrub. I am wearing pants, by the way. A lot of lip scrubs, not gonna lie, and you can't lie to me either. We just eat it. But this one feels like there's Vaseline in it. Uh, and it just feels like it never comes off, so I have to wipe it off anyway. But it's fine. Next thing is L'Oreal Hydrogenius. Ah! Uh, stab myself with my lack of. Ow! What the hell is that? Feels like there's like a mini knife in that finger. What the hell? I'll tell you what, ow. I think I had a piece of the freaking lip scrub still on my finger. And so when I went to like, rub my eye, it was like kind of, ow, no, it's not the lip scrub. What the hell? Why is my finger like trying to kill me? Can I cut it? Yep. Yeah? Okay. Chapstick. I feel like it works really well as a primer also because it's not like super tacky but it's like enough where it helps things stick better and it's also moisturizing. Let it jiggle. That's the best part. <laughs> okay. So I got some. I'm gonna need more than this probably. It says to put it like in the areas that you're most dry, but I'm a dry ass bitch, so. Last thing. I'm pretty skeptical. Skeptical. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty skeptical about setting sprays in general because I don't really feel like they do anything. I don't feel like they help keep your makeup on for longer. I just feel like it helps like melt the powder in and like make you look not as dry, which I'm okay with. Normally I do my eyebrows before I even do skincare because once I put moisturizer on, my eyebrow don't stay. It just like slides right off. I like, I'm using the ColourPop uh, No Filter Concealer in Fair number two. Is my hair in that? Nope, that was my eyelash though. That's fine. And then, use this Morphe M173 brush. Oh yeah. I also bought this concealer for under my eyes and it's so dry that I, I just, I don't know. I mean like, my face is dry, but if you add this, I'm literally a desert and I would prefer to be a dessert, you know what I mean? I'm so stupid, I just woke up. I'm sorry, my jokes are gonna be awful. Not that they weren't already always awful. I am so not awake yet. Oh, the house phone! Stop calling, nobody answers here. 
Oh yeah, it's a whole lot of nobody again. Big f surprise. Not angry. Not angry. I wouldn't dream of being angry. Did I grab the wrong thing? Yeah, that's not it. Oh, that's like devil not it. What? I'm doing my favorite look as of right now, which is which is <laughs> no, which is what I'm gonna do. <laughs> So, what I'm going to do is take this Morphe brush, M535, and go into the shade Subtle. And I'm just gonna put this bitch everywhere. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, see, that's, that ain't this. <laughs> okay. See my necklace right now? It just says Jose. I'm like kind of triggered about that. Oh! There we go. The boy life was fun while it lasted. So I'm also going to be using this mini breaker palette for literally one shade. Um, and that is this one because I like my, um, like the smokiness of this eye that I'm about to do to be a little more cool toned. I really got to stop doing that. Woo. It's like a, it's like a rave in here with one light. <laughs> How stupid of it. Like, would you go to that show? Okay, so I'm gonna be using this shade. It's called Hot Fudge, bitch. It's just Hot Fudge, excuse the bitch. I am Scary Terry. And I gotta be honest, this is one of my favorite looks to do, but I also don't remember how I normally do it because I haven't done it in a while, because quarantine. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, quarantine. <laughs> this is like a very natural eye look, but still like kinda Smokey, the bear, comma Smokey. First name last, last name first. Okay, so now I'm just kind of blending this out with like a random brush that had like not a lot of stuff on it. <laughs> I just don't have any clean brushes. Right. I'm literally staring at two clean brushes. Hold on. Oh my god, three? Are you kidding me? I am a joke. I'm trying to blend these two colors together. New clean brush. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna take drizzle. And I'm gonna go over this one a little bit. And then use this shade to kind of blend the other two together better. I have very hooded eyes also, which is kind of annoying because... I could do like this cool ass makeup look and I'm like, guys, look, <laughs> you're like, look, look at my eyes. Oh, look at my eyelids. Eyelids. Like, what do you mean eyelids wear? My eyelids are my eyelids. All of the Jeffree Star palettes have a mirror on them. So it's impossible not to blind myself when I open it because I'm not going to bend it all the way back like a book. I want to say that this is normally what I would do, but again, I don't, I'm not like fully certain. But if it isn't something that I normally did, it's going to be something that I normally do now because I do really like this. I'm going to be blind by the time that I leave this video. Maybe I'm already blind. That's the wrong brush. Mm -hmm. Already blind. Confirmed. I think we're good. For this, I don't like to put anything on the inside. So I'm just gonna go and put something on the inside <laughs> that is not like pigmented. So got translucent powder. And I'm just gonna use the other side of this brush because now I officially have no clean brushes. Also, this is the Airspun translucent powder, if you were wondering. I'm trying to be respectful of the fact that my mom is downstairs working and she probably does not want to hear me. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, can I talk for a second about how much I hate this chair? Um, like, I appreciate the chair and all it has done for me, which is not much, but, like, this keeps happening. I don't know if you can even see this. Like, it looks like I've been sitting on the toilet for, like, six and a half hours. It's becoming a part of me. We are not in a happy relationship. And I'm gonna do my eyelashes. I already curled this eye, but I'm gonna do it again.
So this is the L'Oreal Voluminous Carmen Bl Carmen Black. My stripper name. <laughs> Carbon Black Mascara. Oh, by the way, this is the Physicians Formula Healthy Foundation. Oh, shade LC1. And then I'm also gonna mix it with the Milani Conceal and Perfect in, I think this is just nude. Oh yeah, nude. So. I'm also gonna use the Milani Conceal and Perfect uh, Concealer in 110 Nude Ivory. I'm also mixing it with Maybelline. Uh, the Maybelline, uh, I'm not sure what it's called. All the letters have melted off. But this is in the shade Ivory, number five. I just kind of use whatever's left and do by my nose. Oh. <laughs> okay, so I'm also gonna be using this. If I can open it. I took my nails off yesterday and now I'm useless. Oh God, okay. Uh, this is the Essence Brighten Up Banana Powder. Like. <laughs> did this a little out of order, but it's fine. I'm gonna use the NYX Cream Contour Palette. This is like way too dark for me, but uh, we'll make it work, we'll make it work. I know this isn't the right brush for it, but this is all I have at the moment. Oh, there's powder in it too, which is great. I'm gonna take this. I don't know what brush this is. I really don't. I could. I <laughs> There's no brand or anything. It's probably from like Wish or something. Wow, that was literally nothing. Okay, great. We're getting somewhere, we're getting somewhere. Oh, this is a e.l.f. stippling brush. It's the smallest one that they have, I believe, for your face. And for my nose, I'm gonna use my sponge still because powder and burr goes on the same on your nose with a brush. Okay, so now use the Morphe bronzer. This is in Celebutant. It's called Brontor. My bad. Take a dusty brush and so whirl it around. For contour, I use this on this like huge fan brush. <laughs> That's it. That's all I do. So I'm also gonna take a little bit. Jaclyn Hill. I think this is the flash palette. <sighs> that's the highlight that's blinding me, not the mirror. <laughs> I can't close it, I actually need it. So I'm gonna use the same brush that I used for my nose. This is the Real Techniques uh, setting brush. Hi. I'm gonna take the shade Mes Mesmerized and Iced and I'm putting that higher up on my face. <laughs> I know it's not bited, but we're gonna say bite it. I got Joe bited, Joe Biden. Not like you could just pop it or anything. You can't pop, lock, and chop that bitch. You just gotta wait for the bite to heal. Very annoying. I had a 
flip my direction and the camera for lighting purposes. So now that like base face is done, I am going to do my lips. This is the NYX lip liner in, oh, that's the wrong one. <laughs> so this <laughs> is the NYX lip liner in natural. problem that I found <laughs> I like leaned back too much and like I'm sitting on the back of my shirt so it pulled it and it like it choked me completely I'm also going to take the one that I grabbed the first time on accident which is nude pink still a NYX lip liner and I'm gonna do the inside who that? spam risk no, thank you, please. But I just take like a little, it's a little eyeshadow brush, but I'm using it for my lips. And I just kind of go over everything, you know, blend it out. And then the last thing, take my sponge with just whatever's left on it, dab it in the middle, and then kind of bring it out. Just trying to keep you on your toes. This is my Anastasia Dip Brow in Ebony. I don't even use this for my eyebrows anymore. I just use it for my birthmark. Because like you could still see it even right now. Like, I have a birthmark right here. And it still shows through through my makeup, but it's not as dark as I would like it to be. And then go over it with my sponge. I think I'm gonna use these. These are the Kiss Lashes number 11. These are the ones that I always come back to for like when I want a natural eyelash. Usually when I'm not feeling eyeshadow or like a whole lot of makeup, I'll just wear these. These are normally like seven or eight dollars, I want to say, for like a two-pac. But uh, I got them at my beauty store for four. So I'm cool with that. My microwave keeps beeping. It'll keep beeping until you stop it, until you tell it to shut. I don't know why. Do not know why. It's a needy little bitch. Bottom mascara. I don't leave without it. If you have fine lines under your eyes or if you generally feel like you look tired, bottom mascara. I also like to point out that I bought a mascara from e.l.f specifically for my bottom lashes. The wand is super tiny and it was perfect for this and I cannot find it. I cannot find it. I could not find it here or there. I could not find it anywhere. Do not want green eggs and ham. I do not want them Sam I am. This is how I've been doing my hair. Pulling out the little, little fringy bits and then literally just taking a pair of sunglasses and pushing the rest of my hair back. I'm bringing it forward. She cute. Okay, so I actually should have done this before, but I'm also gonna take uh, just this flat eyeshadow brush and go in with this color and put it under my eyes a little, just in the outer corner. I know that doesn't make that much of a difference to anybody else, but it makes a difference to me, so. So that's all I got. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on post notifications if you want them. You can also follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter at Who's Josie, but the links will be included down below. I'll probably also link everything that I used here today, just in case you want to buy something, you know? So thank you guys again, and I will... See you next week. I know it's not like a happy time right now. I know it's more so a scary time and an anxiety ridden time, but use this time to do the things that you normally couldn't do otherwise. See it as an opportunity rather than a setback uh, and just try and stay positive. Be smart, make good decisions. Don't be a dumbass. All right, 
you could stay inside, stay inside. If you want to go for a walk, that's fine, but stay the hell away from people. Just be smart for your sake, for your family's sake, for your friend's sake, and for the sake of humanity. Uh, because we all need, we all just, we need, we're all, we're all in this. You directly affect the next person, so just don't be stupid. Be safe and happy quarantine. See you next time. Oh! <gasps>